Mark 10 opens with this discussion on divorce, and many people are right to be sensitive and trepidatious when they discuss the topic. I've heard some say, oh, the, the marriage itself is dead, so why not just put the nail in the coffin, sign the papers, etc. And so the Pharisees ask Jesus, is it lawful for a man to divorce his wife? And of course, with the law, for a good Jew, you run back to Moses. What did Moses command you? Well, Moses allowed a man to write a certificate of divorce and to send her away. And Jesus says to them, because of your hardness of heart, he wrote you this commandment. But from the beginning of creation, God made them male and female. Therefore, a man shall leave his father and mother and hold fast to his wife, and the two shall become one flesh, so they are no longer two, but one flesh. This one flesh union touches the very core of creation because God in the very beginning made them male and female. People are right to be sensitive about this because it's not only about husband and wife, it's about Christ and the church. And wherever Jesus is involved, salvation is involved. So if you want to be a member of the body of Christ, a member of his bride, the church, that's a one flesh union with Christ at the consummation of all things. So treat it carefully. You're listening to Orazio, part of your morning drive for the soul, here on Worldwide KFUO. Christ for you, anytime, anywhere.